On May 2, 2008, Cyclone Nargis caused unprecedented death and destruction in southwestern Myanmar. More than 84,000 people died. 54,000 remain missing. The lives of 2.4 million people were forever changed. Immediately after the cyclone struck, people from inside and outside of Myanmar joined together to save lives. With more than 600 staff already on the ground, World Vision Myanmar began responding with locally purchased sacks of rice, drinking water, tarpaulins, and medicines. Continued support from donors enabled World Vision to ramp up its response. Urgently needed survival supplies reached nearly 350,000 people. One year on, with hard work, resilience, and extraordinary dedication, many of them are on their way to recovery. When the disaster strikes, children are the most vulnerable. The United Nations estimates more than 1 million children were directly impacted by Cyclone Argus. World Vision's 108 child-friendly spaces helped some 17,000 children after the storm. Local volunteers and social workers were trained to recognize and reduce psychological scars. Cyclone Nargis showed no mercy on schools, destroying school buildings, furniture, and books. World Vision is constructing 16 new schools, complete with furniture and school supplies. One year on, World Vision is running non-formal education and early childhood development classes, creating more learning opportunities for children in rural communities. The cyclone overwhelmed health services. Clinics were damaged or destroyed, severely limiting the provision of health care. Eleven health clinics were repaired and four new health centers built in the Eyawadi Delta. Hospitals also received medical equipment and examination beds. <laughs> More than 2,000 drinking water ponds in the delta were contaminated by debris and salt water. Tools were provided to clean hundreds of water ponds. Over the next year, rehabilitation of water sources will continue. 16 water purification machines were also provided. Some with the ability to purify 10,000 liters of drinking water in one day. World Vision gave water containers to 90,000 families. Over the next year, workshops on the importance of hand washing and use of latrines will continue. After the cyclone, many of the agriculture and fishing activities in the delta came to a standstill. One year on, more than 700 fishermen are back at work in Hanji, Bugali, and Kapo. They receive boats and threads for weaving fishing nets from World Vision. <laughs> World Vision helped more than 4,000 farmers prepare for the first planting season. Hand trackers, threshing machines, 
and packets of gardening seeds were provided to families across the Delta. World Vision Myanmar will continue to coordinate its Cyclone Nargis recovery projects with the United Nations agencies, government of Myanmar, faith-based groups and others to ensure the highest impact on communities. World Vision is committed to building secure futures for children and their families in the world. Regarding monitoring and evaluation, we incorporated the system to know what we are doing in quantity and quality. We monitor the activities and outputs during the intervention period and evaluate the outcome and impact of what we did in the mid and at the end of our intervention. Our Cyclone Nargis recovery program will focus on long-term assistance for 100,000 people in Bogale, Hanji, and Piapo. By rebuilding stronger, more resilient communities, World Vision will assist the people of Myanmar towards recovery for years to come.